Welcome to the Center of Math problem of the week. For this week's problem, we want to find the minimum possible absolute value of an argument of a complex number that can be represented as a product of an 18th and a 48th root. So we want to basically find the uh, complex number with the smallest angle. So. Uh, one quick addendum, we want the uh, angle to be non-zero as well. So we have, uh, you know, say z1 to the 18th equals 1, z2 to the 48th equals 1. So z1 we can re represent as any complex number with the form e to the i 2 pi p over 18, where p is any integer. Uh, clearly that to the 18th will give us 1. Uh, similarly for z2, now if we multiply these two together, we get our complex numbers that can be represented as a product of two of these roots. So together they form something of the form e to the i 2 pi 4 8 p plus 18 n over 4 8 times 18. This sum on the top is just k times the greatest common divisor of 4 8 becoming 18. But then if we bring this on bottom, 4 8 times 18 divided by the greatest common divisor is just the least common multiple of these two. So this is equal to e to the i 2 pi k, where k is any integer. And uh, we have the least common multiple of 48 and 18 on bottom. And this is 144. So the angles are all the uh, possible integer multiples of 2 pi over 144. So 2 pi k over 144. And uh, looking for a non-zero angle, since k can be zero, we get our smallest possible angle would be 2 pi over 144. So notice really uh, all our angles are really kind of generated by multiples of 2 pi 144. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, please check out centermath.org and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you.